In this video, I'm going to show you how to want, make one of my all-time favourite cocktails. It's a rum-based cocktail and it's the Hurricane. Hey there, I'm Steve the Barman and I'm hoping these videos help you drink, serve and enjoy your favourite drinks. Right, let's get into this one. This is one of my all-time favourite cocktails. So simple, so easy. It is the Hurricane kind of uh, it's where this glass originates is where it gets its name from the hurricane glass uh, it originates from New Orleans so what better rum and uh, as I say it's a rum based cocktail what better rum to use than and I love spiced rum as well uh, and this is Bayou spiced rum again from New Orleans now there's a couple of different ways you can make this cocktail I'm just going to make it straight into the glass you could make it into a cocktail shaker, give it a shake and then strain it. However, I'm gonna use a uh, fresh passion fruit in there as well. So I just like make, uh, making it straight in the glass, giving it a good old churn. So to start off with, um, Bayou Spiced Rum. I've done a uh, Spiced Rum review all about this. Absolutely love this. Cracking Spiced Rums. Uh, easily in my um, top 10. Um, just very, very simple. 50 ml straight into your glass. Then we want some fresh uh, lemon juice. So I've got some fresh lemon juice already squeezed and I'm going 20 ml of lemon juice. Go 20 ml. Now, um, it's essentially a passion fruit based drink. Now there's a couple of different ways you can do this. Uh, I've always got plenty of a Rubicon uh, passion fruit in the house because of porn star martinis and things like that. However, I'm gonna use a puree for this. So, and this is uh, this is my favourite puree now. Uh, I did a taste test against Funkin uh, a few weeks ago. This one, absolutely love this. Really, it's kind of long life as well, shelf, uh, shelf stable. Now, just for this, I want 30 mil, okay? There we go, 30 mil going in there. Now, the piss puree is um, uh, sugar-based as well, so I think it was actually 40% passion fruit puree. Yes, 40% passion fruit puree and the rest is sugar in there. So you, you don't need any extra sugar to sweeten that up. However, um, some hurricanes you'll see a bright red, some of that. I actually do like making this a little bit red in colour. So I'm just going to use a little bar spoon, about 5ml, actually do 5ml in here, uh, 5 ml of, and this is pomegranate, pomegranate uh, syrup, so proper, proper grenadine, not grenadine as such, but proper, proper grenadine, pomegranate syrup. And then all I want is just the, um, the pulp of half a passion fruit. So just chop that in half. Lovely, ripe passion fruit. And I just want half, get all that pulp in there, half a passion fruit. So simple. Now you could, the recipe hasn't got bitters or anything like that in there, but you could add um, some bitters if you really wanted to. I'm not gonna bother. I'm just gonna whack some crushed ice in there now. There we go. Three quarters fill out with crushed ice. Now I'm just gonna churn the cocktail, blend it all together, bring all those ingredients together. Give it a good old stir through. Now I'm just going to top that up with more crushed ice. A little bit more. One final churn. Get all those passion fruits in there. There we go. Leave a little gap. Now just to garnish, I'm just going to uh, pop the other half of the passion fruit in there. I like, I love using pineapple spears as well, pineapple leaves. Just going to whack a little bit of a pineapple leaf in there and then a straw, and that is one of my, it's kind of a tiki cocktail as such, but as I say, it comes from uh, New Orleans, it's absolutely fantastic, this cocktail. So simple, so easy, that, ladies and gents, is my hurricane, one of my favorite drinks of all time. Cheers.